And the Wellesley Police Chief tells us he can't remember the last time they had a dog napping in town. The police joined forces with neighbors and made short work of this case. Eight-month-old Ember is one lucky dog, and she has her determined family and good old-fashioned police work to thank. The Black Lab pup went missing from the front yard of her Wellesley home last week. At first, the Nissen bombs thought Ember had gotten loose, but realized her tether was intact and started to suspect she was actually taken. The Wellesley police got right on the case. They didn't think we were crazy when we thought that the dog was stolen. They, you know, they agreed with us that it just didn't seem right. While the family started hanging missing posters around town, Officers Derek Harris and Mike Menkovich went door to door collecting security video from neighbors and noticed a suspicious car circling the street. Its license plate led them to a house in Framingham. While they were conducting surveillance, the uh, the suspects brought the dog outside. Police confronted and arrested Manuel Sierra and a female companion, then called Neil and Ilana Nissenbaum to tell them Ember had been found and was safe. I could see her on her phone with this huge smile <laughs> on her face. The kids were ecstatic. I was really happy. We were like screaming. All of my friends were screaming. Ember's owner is now grateful to police and their neighbors and still trying to comprehend how anyone could steal a dog from a family. We had a slip and slide. Uh, literally right next to where the dog was. They you know, should have known. That, yeah, that, that, pretty that, obvious. Yeah, that we had kids. Now, the alleged thieves told police that they have some health issues and they thought having a dog might make them feel better. They'll be in court next month on larceny and conspiracy charges. In Wellesley, I'm Mary Saladna, WCBB News Center 5.